Hello everyone, it's Shane Kanto, your Wasteland reviewer, and I'm here to review The Painter and the Thief. And this is a new documentary by Benjamin Ree about a man who stole these paintings from this artist, and then he's forced to meet with her and spend time with her as she draws paintings of him. And their budding relationship and the connection that they build and each of their own personal struggles, which they surprisingly go through a lot of things, whether it's a major car accident that puts him up in bed and him having to get nursed back to health, or her being in a financial situation that's burdensome. And this is a really surprising documentary because it feels so very human. And that relationship is so powerful over time and you see it grow and their interactions are so just real and powerful. And I was really drawn in to this budding relationship between these two people, these very two very unexpected people that you are sitting there, it's like, this is interesting how they get connected with each other and seeing this, their chemistry and what they develop between each other is something unexpected. And especially how this documentary is shot, it never feels like a documentary. None of them are talking directly to the camera. They're never really interviewed. This is just honestly feels like a drama. It's that enthralling. And I love that about this. I felt so connected to these characters. They're real people. But how this was all staged was something where it's like, you're a fly on the wall. You're really in it. And that wall's never broken. And you just feel this connection, this emotional connection with these two human beings. And over time, you see their relationship evolve. It's like an extremely well done drama. And like, it's hard to think that somebody could have written something better than this. And the, the two of them together, it's so intriguing and so emotional and so powerful. And it's hard to watch at times. And you watch them struggle and they wear it on their sleeves. And you get to be a part of all that. And it never feels like things are being spoon fed to you. You never feel like you're taken out of it because then it cuts to some of them like sitting in a camera in front of like this and talking about their issues. It's like they just live it and you live it with them. And that takes a special kind of filmmaker to make a documentary that's so engrossing that you kind of forget that these are real people and you think you're just watching a film. A drama that was written by somebody, staged by actors, but no, these are real people and this is definitely something special to check out. It's on Princeton Garden Theater's website, which is where I rented it, but it's also popping up elsewhere. But I highly recommend The Painter and The Thief. It's one of the best documentaries of this year so far, and I've watched a lot of documentaries, honestly, of 2020. But those are my thoughts on The Painter and The Thief. Let me know what you think, and let's talk some movies. But thank you, as always, for tuning in and supporting your Wasteland Reviewer.